And tonight, the people of Fordyce showed us what it means to truly be a community. With just hours notice, hundreds showed up for an impromptu vigil to honor the victims of Friday's shooting. Jessica Rank joins us now from Fordyce. Jessica, many described tonight as powerful. Yeah, Gary, and really that's the only way that you can put into words tonight's vigil. I took a step back and just looked across the parking lot, which was full of people just hugging, holding hands, leaning on each other through this tough time. And it truly was amazing to see just how much this community cares. Now we captured just a small piece of just a bigger story here tonight, but take a look. This community's hurting right now. <laughs> they need to see people willing to stand up and stand behind. Them. Need to remember that there was those that was here that suffered consequences of an act of violence. Kind of unbelievable when we start hearing names because I know everybody. We have friends. From either one of them being my daughter's babysitter at one point to going to school with people. I know so many people want to ask the question, why? Why didn't you do something? We need to support each other no matter what that looks like, no matter what it takes. Truly a lot of broken hearts here tonight, but one thing's for sure, this community is going to come together and rebuild from this. Now, Madison did mention a little bit earlier the candles that are still lit tonight. Each one of them have the names of the victims of this shooting who were either injured or unfortunately died, and they will remain on throughout the night and for the foreseeable future. Gary.